Well, police found the woman dead inside the apartment, inside the bedroom of her apartment here on Brazil Avenue. Now, friends said the woman gave birth just a few weeks ago. Police say the baby is in the hospital after having complications from the delivery. And neighbors said today they woke up to gunshots early this morning. But it was just three shots and, it just got quiet. and then it got quiet. Police were called to this apartment around six in the morning and officers found 32 year old Jessica Ann Chavez dead. Neighbors say she lived here with her boyfriend and they say they saw him after they heard gunshots. I looked in the window right. and all I could see was him dashing out in his car like going like fast, fast. like out the parking lot. We didn't know what happened. Detectives identified 24-year-old Irvin Ruiz as the suspect. He was found in Poto by police and arrested. Ruiz is facing a first-degree murder charge. One minute you're, you're breathing and you're just fine, and then next you just take your last breath and you didn't even know it. It's a shock for people who live here. Just a thin wall separates Tyler Smith and Coda Weir's apartment from their neighbors. We can hear everything that they do throughout the night. Like, this ain't the first episode that they had plenty yeah, of times. Yeah, they be banging on the walls. Like, they'll turn the music up so it sounds like nobody can hear them. And then you can hear the banging and the yelling and the screaming. And then it all stops. And late this afternoon, an extradition hearing was held in LaFleur County, Fort Ruiz. Investigators say soon he'll be heading back to Arkansas to face the first-degree murder charge. Live in Fort Smith, Brett Rains, 4029 News.